hello guys welcome back to coding cafe my name is Mohammed Ali and in this video we are going to work on the delete my account button basically when a user click on this button then it will uh, delete his account information from the database that is let's say in this case I am signing in so it, it is displaying my information so when I click on the delete my account it will delete this whole row for from the database okay it will delete my uh, account completely from the database so yeah let's do that so before we proceed one thing uh, which I want to tell you guys is uh, go to the sign up okay and in the sign up form when we sign uh, create a new account for, for the users then here uh, when the operation is successful we are displaying this message and we are sending the user to the home page so instead of sending the user to the home page what we are going to do is to send the user to the sign in page okay so we want the user to sign in first then we will uh, the user can use the uh, app so please make sure to do this change otherwise if you want to send it to the home page then you have to perform the same thing which we are doing here on the sign form that is we are creating the uh, static variable okay the same thing you need to do this okay and we are storing this information in a data table which is dt users so you have to do these things if you want to send the user from the sign up to the home page but in this case we just want the user whenever the user creates new account we will uh, send the user to the sign in page so that he can log in and here we can tell the user account get successfully please log in now that's it now let's close this and go back to the delete account thing so here on our home page let's come here and double click on this button so this is the event listener for our delete my account button okay the name in this case is button one okay so yeah let's do this so first we want to uh, create a dialog result or you can say a dialog box which will ask the user are you sure to delete your account so dialog result dialog equals to message box dot show and we are going to give a message to the user are you sure and the title for this dialog box will be delete account comma and the buttons here we want to message box buttons dot yes no comma message box icon dot warning and then you can say if dialog become equals to dialog result dot yes so if the user press yes button then we will delete the account so let's write a query query equals to and here we can say delete from our table which is users where id equals to and id is basically over this column okay as every uh, user carry a unique id put single quotation here and after this double quotation add concatenation sign in here we can say sign in dot id plus double quotation then single quotation and then again double quotation so this is our delete query which will delete from the users table a specific id from the id column if this id is equals to the user who is already signed in okay so according to that that specific user information will be deleted from the database now we have to execute this query so we have already created object of our dbxs class by the name of djdbxs dot now first of all we have to pass this query to the uh, sql command so we can say sql command and we can give it a name as delete command equals new sql command and here we need to pass over this query and now here we have to execute our query so for that come here above uh, the thing which we do for the updation all you're going to need is to copy this intro and also this if else statement and you will change it for the delete so paste that here and here we need to change this 
update command with the delete command and if the account is created uh, success uh, i mean if the account is deleted successfully then we can say account deleted successfully and we want to send the user to the sign in page and in case of any error we are displaying the error so yeah that's it now let's uh, run the app so the app is running now successfully now let me log in by my email what is our new email it is ali at the red gmail.com and then my password and now let's log in so here you can see this is my information now let's click on delete account here you can see delete account are you sure no now let's again click yes and here you can see account deleted successfully press ok and now if i go to the database let's see it so you can see my information is deleted successfully from the database so my account is deleted successfully from the database so yeah this is working fine this is amazing this is incredible so that's it for this video and see you guys in the next video. Bye for now.